Unbeknownst to Stentor's complement, they were spotted by a Japanese submarine, which had them perfectly in sight. The ship was lit stem to stern with bright lights to show that she was a hospital ship, but the commander of the enemy submarine didn't seem to care. The warhead had detonated at the exact site of the port fuel tank, sparking a fire that suddenly roared out of control and burned white hot. Many on board were killed by the impact or the fire, but then the ship began to take on a huge volume of water through the 33 foot or 10 meter wide hole left behind by the torpedo. Centaur began to quickly settle in the water and those aboard only had seconds to act. She began to roll onto her port side, too quick to launch any of the lifeboats, and in just three minutes, the centaur had capsized and sunk into the waves, leaving behind clumps of bewildered, terrified survivors floating alone in the darkness. Of 332 people aboard, there were only 64 rescued survivors who had to spend 36 hours in the water, 